Hey everybody, Katie Zaromsky here, your venturing realtor with Zaromsky Realty Group. And if you can't tell, it's snowing. <laughs> so I am doing a quick short video today all about a car safety bag. And I'm sure most of you Coloradans have them, but I wanted to run down a few things that you should definitely have in your bag. I'm going to drop a link below with more of a detailed list, but just a few items because let's be honest, it's not about being trapped in your car. I mean, yes, that can happen. But being out here in Northern Colorado, you can go somewhere for what you think is gonna be a day trip, a road closes down, and all of a sudden you're spending the night in a hotel. So make sure that whatever is in your bag is also going to be helpful if you're staying in a hotel for the night. Have an extra pair of clothes, blanket, some non-perishable food items. If you have kids, double up on all that. <laughs> I know for my kids, I not only bring extra warm clothes, extra blankets, but I also bring a few games that are age appropriate. Keeps them occupied because you don't know how long you're gonna have to stay there for, or if you're sitting in a winter traffic jam, it might be helpful too. Also, those break apart hand warmers, you can find them almost anywhere. Otherwise, they have a really nice deal right now going on on Amazon. Bring <laughs> make sure that you have fix a flat and any type of kitty litter to give yourself some traction. A shovel is definitely a top necessity in your simple tool kit that you should have alongside with a first aid kit. So these are just a few things to run down a list. Like I said, I'm going to drop it below more details. If you have any questions, feel free to message me, but it is 12 degrees outside right now and I just finished shoveling. So I'm going to go get some hot cocoa and get warm inside. Hope everybody's having a great Sunday. Bye guys.